hello guys um i'm i'm going to show you just a few java basics uh this is for those of you guys who are for the idea that java can only be used to create a um, graphical user interface uh, applications but java has the capability of interacting with the uh, with the filing system of a lot of uh, operating system and uh, you can be able to create some uh, good application using java and uh, automation processes you don't need uh, a graphical user interface now i'll just take you through uh, a tutorial i'll just take you through the basic uh, examples first for beginners so if you're there you've never seen java you don't know what it is uh, i would encourage you first of all to download the, your favorite id for, for, me, for me i'll use netbeans you can use whichever id you feel comfortable with and also make sure you have java in your in your in your machine uh, right now i'm just going to open my my id i'm using netbeans 7.21 okay and it opens into a screen like this okay uh, i'm going to select file i'm going to select new project first of all uh, i just want to show you how to make a directory or a folder into a, into any location of your system that you choose choose java on these categories in projects use java application click next uh, you name your project whatever name you want to call it i'll name mine make directory okay and i'll click finish and uh, when the creation of uh, the project finishes the uh, the id take you to a page like this where you have the package name that's the package name that's the class name and this is the main class okay so i'll just import <coughs> the the filing system the java.io and i will import all the all the classes import java dot io dot uh I can import one one class at a time, but for now I'll import all of them. So I'll just put star here, and uh, and uh, and, uh, and, uh, and a semicolon at that point. And I've imported the file the file class for for Java. Now I'll come to my main class. I can remove this. I'm just going to remove that, and uh, I'm going to initiate the file. File f. I'll say is equals to new file not java is case sensitive so the file has to be capital f and i'll put a path of my choice here say f f um, and i'll say now I'm, I'm i'm declaring that that directory will be created in the in the drive f and i can call it whichever name i want to say test <coughs> test directory okay i've initiated that so i will just give now the condition for for creating this this directory if the directory does not exist in that location then it is going to be created <coughs> sorry so i'll say if if does not f does not that means when i put the the exclamation mark it means does not so i'll put dot exists say like that exist okay if now that means if the directory f does not exist then i'll i'll call the the make directory uh, function so i'll say f dot make directory okay so the file f the directory test directory will only be created if it does not exist in this file so we can say else and we can see if it's made then you can call the output system dot out dot print whatever you want to say say directory created successfully 
so if it's created then this is the this is the output that you will see what if it's not created for one reason or the other for example if it exists if this this will be created if this condition will this f dot make the regular system dot out dot print will be will be called if this condition is met if directly f does not exist what if it does exist else else what do you do else you can just call system dot out dot r that directory Let's just system dot r dot print line <coughs> print line dot directory already exists. Okay. So that's it that simple so we call the file function at this point the file f is new file where the file will be if the file f does not exist then the directory is created <coughs> the directory will be created and you'll have this output the directory created successfully else if the file so if it's not if it does not exist the other default is that if it exists so the system will just throw an error that the directory already exists now you can just come to <coughs> your project node then right click you can just run Let's see what happens directory created successfully you can see the directory has been created successfully so <coughs> if i go to my drive app right now i expect to find an empty directory called test directory let's see computer f Here it is, test directory. It has been created in my in my drive F. Okay, I'm just going to close this. I'm going to relearn the program again, my simple program again. I'm going to right click and run. See, the output directory already exists, and this time, the output is in red because uh, the function is not out. It's error. The error fun the error output system dot r that's why this will be will be done in in red run the directory already exists now i'm going to delete that directory manually go back to f i'm going to i'm going to delete this to delete it and i'm going to run my program again director created successfully because it's not there so that's that's one of the simple things you can do with uh, with with, uh, with with java filing system in the next tutorial i will show you now how to write a file create that directory and uh, write a file create that directory and then write a file inside that directory uh, a blank text file probably in that directory uh, until then thank you so much for joining me in this tutorial i hope you you will get uh i hope you get your interest in in learning java because uh, it's interesting and it can help you do a lot of other things thank you so much